The Guam Regional Medical City's opening date has been pushed back again. PNC's Rizal Romanis reports it might take another two to three weeks. When will the island's new private hospital, the Guam Regional Medical City, be opening? After many setbacks and construction delays, the only thing the facility is missing now is an occupancy permit. We're talking about a very complicated facility. This is not a house or it's not even a hotel. It's, it's more complicated than that. Department of Public Works Director Glenn Leon Guerrero says because GRMC's as built plan differ from their original plan, a thorough review, which normally takes three to four weeks, has to be done. We're reviewing the as built plans as we speak. Um, and it's not just the Department of Public Works that's reviewing it. other agencies like Guam Environmental Protection Agency, Guam Fire, etc. And, and all these other uh, agencies that, that uh, uh, have to review our, our buildings and facilities to make sure that they're safe and, and, in, and, and in compliance with uh, Guam Building Code. Three weeks ago, PNC took a tour of GRMC where the management team anticipated taking in their first patient on June 23rd. However, that did not happen. CEO Margaret Beng Zong says GRMC looks forward to announcing the start of patient services soon. They are just working with local regulatory partners on final clearances. According to Leon Guerrero, the GRMC team has been very proactive in trying to get the building up to code. In fact, he says they have a great facilitator working with all the agencies. Leon Guerrero says after the various Guam agencies approve of the as built a plan, the last stage is the final feature. Field inspection. So we would go out and, and you know we look at the entire tire facility, and if it if it uh, if it checks out with the S belts and everything is good, then we give it a, a, an occupancy permit, and they can occupy. They can actually uh, entertain guests and, uh, uh, or sorry, in, in this case, accommodate or begin to take patients. Rosal Romanes, P.